All right, we're at Embassy Suites. I thought it was a lot bigger online, but that's fine. It's just two levels. and there's three levels one that goes down this is the entry level and then a third level and they do have common snacks from like five to seven but they don't have them put out because of you know the whole covid so you have to like get in line at the bar and ask for it and there's like a long line and at this point we're like let's just check in when it's too hard to get a free snack, sometimes it's just not worth it. Laundry room. That's nice. 2.15. A little fainting couch outside of our room. What? I said a little fainting couch outside of our room. Yeah. And there's an elevator right there. And the lights. <laughs> All right. It's like a suite. What? It's a suite. All right, Robert asked for a special view. And wow. Oh my God. You can see the mountains. And then you can also see someone's underwear. That's, wow. It's literally, that's someone's bra and underwear. Jeez Louise. All right. Oh my God, there's two entries to the bathroom. Tricky, tricky, tricky. All right, this, this is better. A little better view. Oh, I can still see that lady's bra. Whew. Little kitchenette, coffee, table for the, you know, cause we didn't bring our laptops. So of course they're gonna give us a nice table to work. Oh, I still got my mask. <laughs> All right, very nice. What is this? Closet, no bathtub. That's fine. I always say I'm going to take a bath and I never do. I like it. This room is normally $500 a night, but because we're here for the conference and we belong to the AGTA, we got a discount and I think we're only paying like 160. So heck of a deal. $500 room, $500 room for 160. We'll take it. I like it. Well, we got our mountain view that I was talking about. Yeah. And the bra. You like the nice hot pink bra on the chin? Are you kidding me? No, I'm not kidding you. Why would somebody do that? I don't know. There's underwear over here, too. Oh, my God. <laughs> that is very sad. All right, that's it. That's the that's the room. So, yeah, there are several amenities. Like I said, we could, we could stick around for free snacks, and I think we get a free continental breakfast. But... I think we're gonna just, um, and Robert did request the mountain view, so that is beautiful. Uh, but I think we're just gonna go to a sit down restaurant because I really want some Mexican sit down. That is a good view. I'm well, happy with. You could have been viewing nothing this. I know. Look at that big the only, right there. there is a nice cactus. They only have a couple rooms with views. A lot of these rooms are facing interior. Yeah. They have a courtyard with a pool. And I will walk around and add that to this video because we're on the hunt for cactuses, like that nice, beautiful one right there. It's gigantic. Gigantic. All right, so I think there's one flaw in this design. So right when you enter the room, this is the closet that you put your clothes in. Um... And then here's the bedroom all the way over here. And there is 
a closet in here, but it's locked. This is the utility closet. Honestly, they should have switched those two around. This should be the clothes and that should be the utility. <sighs> Poor design choice. It's pretty artwork though. Good morning, it's the next day. I am walking to the lobby to see what the free breakfast is. During the week, it's six to nine. Bacon. Good morning. Hot fries. Eggs. Okay, I'm gonna go wake my husband up. That's a lot better than I was expecting. All right, I came back for the eggs and the potatoes. Robert added bacon in a Danish. Besides having omelets made, you can also get pancakes made. So I put an order in for two pancakes. And they had hot cocoa. Um, we have a coffee pot in our room, so I got this for later so I can have hot cocoa in the room. So, and this is all free, this is part of the price. Very good deal. Look at those pancakes, don't they look delicious? All right, I'm just gonna add this clip to the hotel vlog because in our um, bathroom here in our room, I noticed the sign that said complimentary toothpaste and toothbrush, and I think razor and shaving too but I just was curious what the toothbrush and toothpaste was like. So I went to the front desk and, and got um, the free toothbrush. Very thin, very not gonna last long, but it'll get the job done for um, the rest of the trip. And then toothpaste and these little, I've never seen them in these little, have you ever seen it like that? Only in a uh, long time ago, whenever they put free samples in the newspaper. So. Oh yeah, because usually, you, when you go to the dentist, they always give you a free toothbrush and toothpaste, and it's just little tubes. Actual flat one like this, I haven't seen before. thought that was pretty cool. And then also, I asked what checkout time was, and checkout time was noon. That's very generous. Wow. Uh, most hotels we've been to, it's been 10 a.m. A couple have been 11, but for it to be noon, I'm extremely happy by that. Um, because uh, if you watched my other travel vlog, our flight was canceled, and we are delayed here a day. And we are heading to Phoenix, but no hurry, no rush, since we're not flying tomorrow. So it's nice to know that we can sleep in and just relax here in the room. And there's a couple things that are pretty close to this hotel that we want to do. So not having to worry about take our luggage or anything, can just leave it in the room until we're ready to um, head back to Phoenix is very nice. So yeah, checkout at noon is a very generous checkout time.